Welcome to the channel, everybody. I hope you're having a fantastic day wherever you are, and if not, well, let's turn that frown upside down. Get a smile on the dial, and let's get cracking with a little bit of American Truck Simulator. I actually need to pull up uh, Euro Truck Simulator and start doing a little bit more of that, too, but uh, we're going to do a couple of deliveries this morning, let's see if we can get that uh, second garage, and see if we can find a Volvo somewhere. Yeah, I haven't got to a, a Volvo shop yet. So I can't buy the Volvo that I want to buy until I do so. But hopefully, the uh, the other two drivers have been doing their work and uh, getting some money for us. But with that all being said and done, let's have a little looky-loo and make sure that uh, everything is good. The first thing is first. Let me just turn this volume down. Have it in the background. Back we order. Greens to chat. Shaleen, how are you doing today? Hope you're having a good day. All right, let's see. Uh, where are we at? We're kind of all over the place, aren't we? You have to go to drive to Houston. Yeah. Ooh, that's a long drive. Oh, you know what? I haven't started up with my trucks box. Damn it. Oh well. Too bad. You're good so far? Well, that ain't the right attitude. You're going to be good for the rest of the day. Come on. She only woke up at about, about an hour ago. That's late for me. As you can probably hear, my throat's feeling pretty knackered. <clears throat> yeah, that's great. Time to get the job done. Let's get the job done. Well, how come it's not coming up on the screen? Is it in here somewhere? The trailer? Um, directions, please. Thought I'd selected it. Yeah. Start off. Did I not select it like set GPS? Okay, it's not coming up on the screen. Alright. Uh, Where the hell is it then? Not in here. Where the hell am I going, by the way? Oh God, I'm going all over the place. Can I get out of here? It is late for me, isn't it? Okay. Well, it's not telling me where to go on the old GPS, so I have no idea where I'm going to. Maybe I need to come out of the lot. Mm. Oh. Okay. Um. That is weird. Okay. Let's see what they have then. Oh, that is the one. Okay, so it was just there. Time to hit cool. the road. Oh God, now it's time. Fine, we are here. Oh yeah. Turn oh. right. Never mind. There we go. It was inside there. I just had to get to the uh, starting point.
<laughs> yeah, that was a bit weird, wasn't it? Yeah, NVIDIA had a, um, a big update this morning. So I didn't exactly have... Um, oh, no, don't go down there, mate. I didn't exactly have uh, a chance to get started properly this morning. Massive big update from NVIDIA. 88 games or something like that, all updated. Oh, uh, yeah. Thankfully, this one didn't. I literally did it uh, about seven minutes before the stream was meant to start. I was like, oh, God, I have to go into my sound settings. I got so used to it now that I just do it automatically. And thankfully, it didn't mess with anything. So, all good. Can Sunday come around already? I want to get back into Planet Crafter. Ready to turn left. Right, here we go. In fact, even yesterday, it's kind of weird. I don't know. I felt kind of off yesterday. I didn't even do any more Death Stranding after the stream on Twitch. Turn left. didn't even do any streaming afterwards. It was very, very strange for me. Three-quarter tank. Okay, I should be okay. It's a big delivery. That's 920 miles. Um, I don't think so. I feel okay. No, I don't. I don't. I, th I think I'm fine. Keep left. Just felt uh, tired, I guess. All right, this is going to be a long delivery. This one. After this, hmm. what to play after this? I wonder. See, that's typically me already thinking of what to play after.
Now listen to me, 44. I've heard you say that already three times, and yet to Keep do it. Left. Come on now. <laughs> Keep right. Why don't we just place a more planet crafter? Why do we why have we gotta wait till till Sunday? Damn it. Alright, get your cup of tea in love. And your biscuits, your jammy dodges. Or your hobnobs. <laughs> Wait, who's got a hobnob? Keep left. Keep left. Toidy. Nah, it's all down to you, mate. I, I, you know, the f funny enough, after the Fallout uh, 76 um, game with uh, Q and, and Lunas, I said to Q, dude, the pressure's all on you now. you got to tell me when you want to do it. I said, I'm not going to ask you. You're going to tell me. So the pressure's on. The pressure's on, on the boyo now. And I'm going to say the same thing to you. Tell me. Because I don't want to Mess up with your schedule. If you have one. Oh, uh, you see? That's my reaction. You want me to play Fallout Q? You gotta tell me when you're ready. <laughs> you don't. You don't have a schedule. Okay, well, you just tell me. You go faster. Let's take her up to seventy. Seventy-one. Well, you just tell me when it suits. Because I'm completely flexible with my schedule. I don't have a schedule anymore. I used to be so, like, I have a schedule for, like, every single day of the week. I'm doing this, I'm doing this, and then, then I said, you're going to drive yourself absolutely nuts trying to keep to that schedule. Just chill out, man. So now I don't have a schedule. I just play what I want, when I want. got to go for a walk? Ah, sending the kiddo to the to the bus stop, is it? Get that walk in, love.
half tank of fuel. Finding new routes. Recomputing. Keep left, and then exit left. Exit left. Uh, we're going to put in for uh, some much needed fuel. Okay, let's find a new route. Keep right. Then turn right. Turn right. Thank you. 
ready to turn right. Turn right. Turn right. left and then exit left exit left keep right and then exit right exit right Come back, 44. How was the walk? Kiddo got on the bus, all right? Keep left. to the rest of the bus stop on his own. Wow, stepping out the kiddo. <laughs> Keep left. Nice, that's good exercise for you, I guess. Uh, keep yourself limber. Ah, <laughs> good kiddo. <laughs> Yeah, that, that's, I mean, that's fair. Come on, let's be honest here. Yeah. Good for him. <laughs> Mom, right. it's embarrassing. Turn right. Turn right. Keep right. Go on, admit it. It's too embarrassing him in in it. That's why you do it.
then turn right. Turn right. Forty-four with the schedule. Uh oh. <laughs> okay. Uh, okay. So Thursday about nine thirty. Thursday. Thursday. That's tomorrow. Thursday nine thirty. Let me think. Um, I'm sure that will be fine. I'm sure that'll be absolutely fine because um, I've got F1 with Aiden to do and that'll be probably Friday morning or Friday afternoon or Thursday afternoon or <laughs> maybe even today I haven't really spoken to, to Aiden much this week so I have no idea what his uh, schedule is or plans are or anything so let me have a chat with him and then I shall let you know but I think it shouldn't be a problem it's not as if we're going to be playing for like seven hours straight so yeah, yeah he pretty much does wing it yeah I see what you did there because he's always playing Microsoft Flight Simulator it's, it's a very clever joke then well done you grab yourself a gold star or a purple one it's all good then grab my purple one that's mine <laughs> you see you see that's a good tongue in tongue in cheek joke in it what's this muppet doing what's this muppet coming in i'll move over for him then Thirty-six miles to go. Uh -oh. Accidental. Oh God, this is going to get ugly. and clear. And the 60 zone coming up. Keep left. See. Oh no, I took the wrong turn. Never mind. I'll find a new route. Yeah, find a new route, mate. Right. To go. And then it's all exit good. Right. You do that too, yeah. I, I, I don't generally do it a lot, but sometimes the uh, the instructions right. are a little bit confusing. Get ready to exit left. I think it's not the instructions. I think it's more like the the highways and everything. There's so much of it. Exit left. Too much of a detour. Keep left. God, 
I've, uh, I've had some detours that's added like in a hundred miles onto the trip. It's like, God damn it, really? Apologies if you can hear um, a lot of talking and, I guess, shouting in the back. The 12-year-old's uh, getting its Afrikaans lesson. Morning, Lunas. How you doing, man? You don't hear anything? Good. Good, good. For a call, that sounds like a good deal, dude. Yeah, comes your man, holds out his hand. He's looking strangely happy. Sounds good, Linus. What, what have you got going on? Job offer, perhaps? security gig. Alright. Eunice is taking his shooty shooty to the real world. Uh oh. Watch out everybody. Private security too. Damn son. This is going to be traveling around the world in a Learjet next. Guarding, like, high profile people. Politicians, you know. It's going to become a contract killer next. Watch out. The Viking hitman. straight on.
Yeah, I totally hear you, dude. You gotta do what you gotta do, man. You gotta be a hitman, you gotta be a hitman. <laughs> How's the family? Who's? Mine? There you go, you see? Yeah, family's doing good. Go straight on. As as good as can be, I guess, you know. It's uh, the twelve year old's getting its Afrikaans lesson at the moment. So there's lots of tension in the air. Lots of anxiety and screaming faces and whatnot. Yeah, not happy. Yeah, but she, if she had her way, she'd rather be sat in front of watching TikTok videos than doing fucking school. No, we expect me to pull in for this way station. There's no way for me to go. Silly game. Yeah, no right. Absolutely ridiculous. I'm not pulling around just so you can weigh my truck. Sort off. Truck is fine. Leave me alone. Nice one, man. Get that 500, you can monetize. Well, offer memberships, right?
<laughs> you know, when YouTube brought in the lower stat, like the lower entry, like 500 subs, I was like, you got to be fucking kidding me. After all this hard work that I put in to get to 1,000, I was like, God damn, you got to be kidding me. And then I was like, eh, put yourself in their position. If you're sitting at 500 subs, do you want to be able to monetize it? Hell yes. Go straight on. Good luck. Funny enough, I got to 1,000 uh, subs, well, I wouldn't say fairly quickly. It felt like it took forever. But I remember hanging on those watch hours. Those watch hours took a long time to come around. But what I do find funny about Twitch is the jump from affiliate to partner. It's a massive jump. I've got two out of the three requirements. The third requirement, 75 people in chat at any one time to become partner. Affiliate was, I think, four people, five people, to suddenly jump to 75. Phew. That's, um, that's pretty harsh. Now, I don't, yeah, I've, I've, um, I get, um, notifications from Twitch because obviously when you affiliate, you get more info about, you know, stats and stuff like that. And I got one and it was just like, you need another 70 viewers or like in chat to get to partner. And I'm like, well, what? Yeah, no, look, dude, honestly, Shaleen, I gave up looking at those numbers about a year ago. I really I just, because it drives you mental. It, it, it's insane. Keeping on top of all of that stuff. Because then it becomes a chore. You know what I mean? The whole point of doing it is to enjoy it and have fun and meet different people. Yes, obviously it's nice to to make money from it. You know, I've always said, I've always said, as long as I can cover my monthly bills, which is about roughly two hundred dollars a month, if I could just do that and not have to rely on the warden to to give me money. To help me pay my bills. I'm not there yet. I make about a hundred, well, between 75 and a hundred dollars a month. I'm not talking about donations or anything like that. I'm talking about memberships. A regular income. And even then it's not regular because people come and go or downgrade their um, membership, you know, or whatever. But it's just having more people become members at the lowest tier possible is the way forward. Yet, yet, that's the word right there, yet. You will. You will. You just got to keep doing what you're doing, keep playing games that you want to play rather than play games that they want you to play. Google's payout scheme is, I think, a, m a minimum of a hundred dollars. 
I think it's about a hundred dollars. Oh no, it's it's um it's not a hundred dollars. It's a uh, thousand rand, I think, of what it is. Payout. So if I don't make a thousand rand, then I don't get paid out. It rolls over to the next month. Sometimes that can be a blessing in disguise. I mean, an anomaly in my streaming term so far, as in the past year, past two years, has been Denende. Denende is the one that sort of really does um, make me pay bills possible. Um, and sometimes when he does like really big donations, um, I buy Jaden shit. Yeah, no, it's just absolutely mental. And it's and and it's and it's weird me just pointing out him because a combination of the members, the subscribers, the people who watch the video, it's the whole thing. But with him, it it makes it very very possible to uh, spoil my kid and sometimes the warden and sometimes myself I still scratch my head sometimes when he do when he donates I actually actually you know what scrap that I still scratch my head every day and say oh, how the hell is this even happening that there are people that watch this Yes, there are haters. <laughs> oh, believe me, there are haters. So easy to hate. People just don't get my sense of humor. <laughs> Jackass. <laughs> You like my sense of humor? Well, thank you very much. So very much. It's a very dry sense of humor. Nobody knows when I'm joking or being serious. Particularly face to face, in person. That's why I've, I have fallen out with uh, many a people. Michael's the same, yeah, I could tell. <laughs> I still blame Michael for everything. Um, yeah, look, a lot of people don't get it. The warden still says, I ne can never tell when you are joking or not. And she lives with me. <laughs> she still doesn't get it. It's brilliant.
exit right. There he is. Turn there right. he is. I mentioned a little earlier about um, schedules and stuff. When are we doing the F1, mate? It's a race weekend. See, talk about him and he turns up exactly. Speak of the devil and he will appear. Welcome, Satan. Did you bring your whippy whippy tail? Tomorrow. Okay, tomorrow afternoon. I can do tomorrow afternoon. I can't do the morning. Uh, about one ish, thereabouts. One o'clock, two o'clock, thereabouts. Two PM, there we go. All righty. 2 p.m. tomorrow on Twitch, F123. And we're about, about three and a half weeks away from F124 coming out. I shall be getting that three days prior to release date. And then tomorrow morning, around about 9.30, 9.30 Shalene's time, which makes it 10.30 my time. We shall be playing the Planet Crafter. Yay! Late start tomorrow then for me. Yay! I get to sleep in. Yeah, I'll probably be awake at 3 o'clock. AM, that is. Forty-four miles out. Yay! I still don't know what I'm going to be playing after this. Damn it! Correct. Yes. I need to do the same as soon as I'm done playing this. Friday will be Icarus then, Go after the update, see what's, uh, there's a, I think next week is, um, this week coming is a big update. Uh, you have to download the entire game again. It's a massive update coming, the restructure to everything. Which I think it's going to be rather exciting. Very, very big update. to that so Friday will be Icarus at some point I'm not going to schedule that because don't know how long the uh, how big the update is going to take to get to download keep right and then exit right um, I think it's an uninstall and reinstall I honestly exit do not right. know What? Keep left, then turn oh, what will happen? Not open. <laughs> uh, what will happen? Yeah, not sure. Yeah, 
Yeah, that's that'll be interesting. It'll be, uh, yeah. I, I, I can foresee a lot of problems with um, saved games, I reckon. Particularly on the server front. Yeah, so do I. It's all over now. Uh, sometimes a restart is uh, more than welcome. Ooh, level 20. Okay, let's see what jobs they have. What do they got? They got a 43,000 and 25,000. Where's that going? All the way to that side. All the way to Oklahoma. It shouldn't affect the saves, no, but I mean, we know how these things are. It can be a right old pain in the butt, can't it? Okay, so we've got 43,000. So let's see what other jobs there are. Santa Fe, there's a 52,000. Let's take that one. What is this? What have we got? So we got a important delivery, a fragile cargo, and a high value cargo. Let's go with that one then. I'm looking forward to the one where they do a, a special. Sometimes every now and then you'll get a special like these ones. They're very, very short, but they are very, very special. Let's do this one. And you know what? Let's do a real fancy one. Let's go. Okay, here we go. Way to get rid of this truck. Turn right. Oh, we the wrong way. See. Okay. Let never mind. I'll find a new route. Okay. Oh, well, I need to go repair and fill up anyway, so let's go this way then. It's always going to be cost 19,000. That'll do. Alrighty. Right. 
turn around and go backwards. I know there's a petrol station. Finding new routes. Turn left. Yeah, I think they're going to take a while to complete this map. Because, I mean, what is there going to be afterwards? You know what I mean? straight off. Alright, here we go then. Turn right, and then turn left. Here we go. This is special delivery. It's when you get police and TV and everything like that. Get a police escort. I like these ones. These are fun. Very slow though. Very, very slow. Yeah, got it. So you get the police that um, block off the road. To turn left. Turn left. Get a full on escort all the way through. But you've got to stick to the rules of the road very, very heavily. Can't change lanes. You've got to get ready to turn right. Follow the the cop big time. Turn right. Keep right, and then turn right. Turn right.
keep left. Keep left. Keep left. Keep left. Like I said, it takes a long time. It's very slow. It's not, not a lot of distance, just you can't go above 40 and you've got to s stick behind uh, the cop here. It's just something a little different. I think they're a lot easier in um, in this game, in ATS, than in ETS. ETS, is, I think, is a lot harder because the roads are a lot more narrow. Yeah, you've got more space, but it is it is nice and chill though. Nice and relaxing, yeah.
keep right and then exit right. Exit right. people waving <laughs> more people waving go straight on go straight right. on right through the traffic lights and all no fines nothing keep right and then turn right turn right straight on Get ready to turn right. Turn right. Is news van piggies Hundred and thirty four miles time taken eight hours. <laughs> Bloody Nora. Has this company got any a hundred thousand dollars? Holy Oh, it's all the way up there though. That sucketh. Hundred thousand dollars. Let's do this. Okay, can we f fast travel? Quick travel. Okay, where was it? <laughs> I think it was there, wasn't it? Was it there? Oh, 
hundred thousand dollars. A hundred thousand. See, that's the Volvo one. But yeah, got to get it first though. Okay. GPS, take me there. Three hundred nine miles. Okay, let's have a look at the map. Billions, is that where it's at? Billions, okay. Where is where is billions? Have I not uncovered it? There we go. Rerouting. Hundred thousand. It's worth it. It is so worth it. Okay. Is this the area? Yeah, 34 miles to go. Okay. Continue straight on. Look how much money we've got at the moment. Go straight on. That, ladies and gentlemen, is a new garage and a whole set of drivers and trucks. So, yeah, we are good to go. Five and forty-five. Breaking the law. Breaking Get the law. Ready to turn right. Turn right. Park trash, yay! I would love to get a Winnebago and travel from east to west across America. Love to do it. It's, it's a bucket list of mine. It'll never happen in my life, but Keep it's still left, a bucket list. Then turn left. Turn left. Turn left. Turn left. Get ready to turn left. Turn left. This is where it ends. No, no, this is where it begins. But that job is still available. Yeah, boy. Time to get the job done. Yeah, this is going to be tough. Tough one, this one. Here we are, safe and sound. Go straight on. Ready to roll. 
Please make a U-turn when possible. Turn left. Never mind. I'll find a new a hundred thousand. A hundred thousand. Okay, let's reroute it. A lot of money. Keep left and then turn left. Turn left. I don't think I've. I, th I think the maximum I've ever been paid is 160,000. And it's not a long distance, only 860 miles, but it's cargo that's important. That's a lot of money. Bloody Nora. Keep getting those high value cargo, get some good money. Plus, your drivers are bringing in the extra two drivers, are bringing in money. So, that's a good thing. Tank too, so that's also good. Go thing. straight on. Cappuccino Jammy Dodger, Dodgy Jammy, whatever it's called. A hobnob. Bloody vehicle inspections all the time. Sod off. Holy crap. <laughs>
Hilaristic, my love. How are you doing, dude? I haven't seen you for a bit. Doing great. Good. Good to hear it, man. What's been cracking? <laughs> Trying to keep up with America. Time zones are messed up, man. I can't even keep up with the ones that are an hour behind me. Let alone like eight and nine hours or whatever. It's crazy. <laughs> yep. I did that for a little bit. I yeah, I know. I mean, look look how difficult it is to get a stream with Q. And he's uh, 9 hours, 8 hours. Nah. Uh, no floristic there isn't. That's why it just says the latest uh, DLCs. Wait, does that does that mean that my thing is clickbaiting? Now I'm a click beta as well. Hey, Bill. <laughs> click baiting. No chat. If you're expecting new DLCs, this is not new DLCs. This is just the latest DLCs that are out currently. Love clicking on wussy. Come on, admit it. Fucking break check me, bitch. Jesus, what the hell? Don't break check me. God damn it. What's that all about? <laughs> we love a good wussy. I've never met a good wussy. Because all you're a bunch of reprobates, man. And wussies. A lot of you. I'm telling you. Giggity, giggity, giggity. Only one way to have a wussy, and that is tight, 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 yeah. 
Oh yeah. Mm-hmm. Oh my god. Who actually remembers Vista? What a pile of dog shit was that program. Holy hell, how could Microsoft have ever thought that was a good program? I'd, yeah, I'd rather take w Windows 98. Absolutely. Windows XP was still the best, man. Just everything and anything ran on XP without any problems. Although I will admit, Windows 11 is pretty damn cool. What? No, Vista came before Windows 10, wasn't it? Windows XP was... Um, before Vista. Ah, uh, yes, you got to have a specific um, hard drive um, uh, security compatibility. Yeah. Yeah, I remember when I got this this gaming PC, I was like, just make sure it's Windows 11 compatible, please. You could have security something enabled on the hard drive or something. I don't know. Why. Yeah, the motherboard and the hard drive got to be, I don't know, something. Some security something. God, I'm so out of the game, even though I had my own IT company for a while. Which feels like years and years ago. There you go. XP then Vista. Yeah. Windows Millennium. <laughs> oh god. Man, I was selling computers. In one of my previous jobs, Windows 95, man. Shaleen, wouldn't it just be easier just to buy a new PC? And in the long run, actually cheaper. And better, basically, overall. Because of having to upgrade everything. If you upgrade your motherboard, your RAM probably won't be compatible. God, Windows 10 was was I thought was okay, but it had so many problems with games. And then I was I was so like, oh, you got a mate that builds it in, builds it for you. Oh, aren't you la di da, la di -da. And Intel are changing sockets again. Yeah, you see, Intel love doing that, man.
I was always uh, an intel person. Always. Always Keep an intel it. person. And then... Uh, and I was never an AMD fan. But for this gaming rig, I went AMD. Probably Keep the best playing. decision I've ever made. Yeah, I've had all them operating systems, yeah. 8.1 was just a... I mean, they had to go 8.1. See, I was the opposite. I had, I had only Intel. And that is purely because of my IT business uh, selling... Um, PCs and laptops always was always um, Intel and I used to build PCs and I felt more happy building uh, Intel based systems I used to love doing that until one day when I blew up my own trying to be clever and then since then, I just get people to build it for me. No ways am I touching PC equipment ever again. Yeah, the 775. I would have to say that the only thing that I would want to upgrade on this system that I have is the graphics card. I would give my one and only left testicle to get a 4090 in here I would love to have an massively upgraded graphics card holy shit that's the one thing I would love but it, to get that card it's the same cost of this whole PC so not gonna happen in other words They're so expensive, the graphics cards. I mean, if money weren't an object, obviously, I would I would do the graphics card. I would upgrade um, the RAM, and I would get. And actually, in fact, I would love to have a motherboard that has um, um, the NVMe's more than one. This one's got two, thankfully. But I would love to have um, one that's got like... I don't know if, the, if, the, if you even get them. I have no idea. Um, like four NVMe sockets. And get like four terabytes in each one of them. Just for storage space. Get rid of all the... Uh, you know, the... The old style... Hard drives. Yeah, that's, see, that's see, that's the one thing. I've only ever had Nvidia in my life. I don't think I've had anything. I, no, wait, I have had a Radeon way, way, way back in the day. In fact, I think I might still have it in my cupboard somewhere. I think I've only ever um, gamed with uh, Nvidia.
326,000 in the bank. 491 miles to go for a hundred thousand dollar delivery. Oh, that's going to be one garage fully upgraded, three trucks, and three drivers. Yeah, they might be pushing it with three trucks, though. Each truck is going to be about a hundred thousand minimum. I buy a second hand. Keep left. Well, two. Yeah, let's see, that's the thing, the Volvo shop, I don't know where it is. Yeah, 44, can you do me a favor? Can you go online and have a look, ask Uncle Google um, where the Volvo shop is in ATS? Then I can just quick travel there and discover it, please. Or anybody. You were just going to do that. <laughs> Great minds and all, you see. Great minds. Uh, 460 miles to go. We're making good time. thing happen in there. New Mexico, Farmington, Oregon, Eugene, Montana, Las Vegas probably going to be the closest because we're going to Washington State, is it Washington D.C.? Oh, I don't know where we're going, we're going somewhere. We're going to be close to Oregon, I think. I think.
Welcome back. You got your char. You got your biscuits. And your tea. You fed the dog. Wow. Where did you go? Good he grief. Left. Don't have biscuits. What the bloody hell nonsense is this? Can't have tea without biscuits. Bollocks to that, man. Where's your hobnobs? There's no way to talk about Michael Trev. Keep left. No, I'm not pulling in. Screw that, man. I'm tired of bloody well going into the goddamn ramp. You can find me a thousand. I don't care. I'm about to make a hundred thousand. Oh, don't find me at all. Even better. Spokane. Um, if you have fines, traffic fines turned on, yes, they can. I've got mine turned off. But I still like to drive slightly within the rules. Keep left. So I should be doing 60. Yeah, there we go. 61, 60. Um, I still like to drive within the rules. Um, but I, I turned it off purely based on uh, the fact that each state from what I've read in the past, each state has their own turning on your headlight times. And if you don't abide by those, uh, those rules and regulations, you can get fined, you get a traffic fine. And I got tired of like, at 6 p.m. I turn my lights on and get a fine. So I was like, okay, I'll do it at seven. I'm in a different set, I got a fine. I was like, oh fuck, what? So I just I, I just turn the traffic fines off and I just try and abide by the rules. Like I'll stop at the traffic lights, you know. I won't I won't drive floristic style. When I've got cargo on, I I kind of try and abide by the rules. But when I don't have cargo on, then I'll speed and whatever. If I'm just getting to a location. Left. 
two forty five to go. Who's gonna go on Twitch? Platy Nora. Yeah, I'm almost done with this. 184 miles to go. And then I'm gonna do buy a garage, pimp it out, and then uh, get some, get to that Volvo garage buy a Volvo for myself, put this truck in the garage and buy another two trucks and then I hire two people. Yay! Or three people. And then I'm probably going to go and sleep because I'm feeling tired. I don't know why. No idea why. I'm just a wussy. Hear me? I'm a wussy and I love it. Awesome, 44. I will definitely um, try and um, stop. And uh, stop by and come and have a looky-loo on the Twitcher, the Twitcher Roonies. And by all means, please post your link here in chat. So that uh, those that are in chat can uh, come and have a looky-loo at your channel and follow on Twitch. Ooh, bridge. Look at that. Nice. There we go. There is Survival Gaming's Twitch channel. Please head on over and follow the channel. Because... You know, it makes sense. Alrighty, 44. See you later on. Ciao, ciao.
Alrighty, chat. We're on our way. We're getting there. 137 to go. Then it's time to find... Yay! Floristic gave you a follow. That's the way to do it. Wait, are you following my channel, Floristic? Why are you not following my channel, Floristic? Damn it, Floristic. You probably are, aren't you? If not, well, there we go, chat. I am. Tits do a lot. Uh, absolutely. Absolutely correct. I'm the biggest tit of them all. So, follow me. <laughs> I, I tell you what, it's the power of the boobies, man. You got boobies, they will follow. That's it. That's how it is. By the way, Chad Floristic said that, not me. <laughs> it wasn't me. I'm just saying. You can't blame the messenger. Ah, uh, you see, that's because I'm the biggest tit that there is. That's why you follow me. Wait, what? <laughs> anyway. Less than a hundred to go. Yay! you got to have balls of steel or none at all. Yeah, absolutely. Absolutely correct. It's okay, Chad. I've got very broad shoulders. And my tear ducts are blocked, so... Hit me with your best shot. Yeah, I'm kidding. I'm a sensitive empath, I tell you. <laughs> Bollocks. Balls of steel, mate. Balls of steel. <laughs> it's all just a facade. I'm telling you. I'm sensitive. God damn it. What is this truck doing? Okay, I saw this. I'm going for it. Alright, you're annoying me. My stupid, pathetic little truck, whatever you are. There you go. See ya. I'm tired of you, mate. Stay behind me. Than big trees, isn't it? It's West Coast style. What do they call them? Redwoods in California? Redwood trees? I think that's what they call them. Redwood forest? Some red, redwood, no, whatever. Twin Peaks vibes, man. I used to love that series. What a mind trip.
36, 35, yeehaw. This looks cool. Ah, Seattle, that's why. Of course it's cool, it's Seattle. Welcome back, Floristic. Go straight on. There are some uh, bases out there to the right that I haven't been to yet. Do a little bit of drivey drivey and see if we can get a uh, that Volvo truck shop. straight on.
hell did they want me to go? <laughs> I don't know where they want me to go. That looks like they want me to go here. You have arrived at your destination. Um, your route guidance is now finished. Wait, what? Um. Where's the delivery point? That is weird, man. Um... I honestly have no idea where they want me to go. I don't see any green delivery point, nothing. Am I the only one that's mental or something? Where is the... GPS? You're uh, a little bit... Um what the hell? Where is the delivery point? Um, okay. Well, shit! Certainly nothing there. What the? F it's shine over there somewhere. You see that? There it is there. What the f No, but that's just the camera place. What the f Man, that is just bizarre. That's just the ca the camera place, yeah. There's also something a little bit further up there. Okay. There was something there. I swear I saw it. There. God, how weird is that? Why wasn't that there when I first came in here? And... Jeez. No, we'll just skip that and go straight to there. Bloody hell, that was weird. Nice. All right. Now we're gonna find this Volvo location. 
Let's get the hell out of here, man. How the hell do we get out of here? No. that all about dude that was weird uh fucking hell all right we're gonna go all the way to the bottom is an exit, right? I mean, it looks like an exit, but it's a, probably only an entrance, okay? Excuse me, chat. gonna try and find uh, there's some stuff to the left that we want to go to as well straight down there what is down here I wonder to the right what is it okay that's a recruitment agency some more stuff to the right. What have we got? That's a Kenworth. Repairs while we're at it. No, 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 fucking hate that. There we go. Okay, got some repairs done. Let us have a look at the map. So there's something there that we don't know what that is. Uh, what was it? Um, wait, isn't there a... Um, was it Portland Eugene? Oregon Eugene? Eugene. Okay, so we've got to get to Eugene. That's where we got to get to. Okay. 
Uh, let's find the petrol station here first. Let's go to there. Time to hit the road. Let's get fuel in and then we'll try and find that. Uh, Turn left. Keep right, and then exit right. Exit right. Get ready to turn right. Turn right, and then turn right. Turn right, and then turn left. Recompute. Never mind, I'll find a new route. When possible, make a U-turn. Let's fill that up. She's thirsty. Let's have a look at this map. So it's Eugene that we've got to get to, which is down here. So there's definitely something there. So let's go to that petrol station there. All right. Okay, here we go. Finding new route. Yeah, let's just clear out all these markers. Drive safe. Go straight on and then keep right. Keep right and then turn right. Let's see how quick we can get there. It's two hundred and twenty four miles. Fair distance. Keep left.
keep left. Keep left. of a tailspin there. Keep right, and then exit right. Exit right. Turn left. All right, let's see if we can find this. Keep right, Volvo and then turn right. Truck dealer. Turn right. Keep left and then turn left. There it is. We are finished. There it is, yay! Another recruitment agency. Is there a truck stop here somewhere? Garage? Volvo, nice. There we go. And there's the headquarters right opposite it. Perfect. Perfect. And perfect.
Yay. Okay. I know how expensive these trucks are. It is not going to be cheap. Okay. So let's have a look at our... Oh, let's just go up here. Um, garage manager. There we go. There we go, Eugene. And that one is small, so we're going to keep that small, but we're going to upgrade this one. Uh, how much money do we have left? How many drivers can we have in there? Okay, we can have three, so let's not upgrade it yet then. So we have three slots, okay. So let's have a look at truck purchases. Uh, where is that? Truck upgrades, trailer purchases. Used, let's have a look at the used trucks and see. Any Volvo? There's none. Okay. But saying that, for the other drivers I'm gonna get, let me let me buy my Volvo first. First and foremost. Alright. Alright, let's see what they got. Okay, the most expensive one is that one there which is 194,000 will be level 23. We're not anywhere near that. We've got 250,000 to spend. So it's very little money, in fact, after purchase that garage. So let us customize this configuration. Okay. Let's see what that looks like. Okay, we go for the high top down. I prefer the low top down. So that gives us a little bit of hill traversal, which is not the be all and end all. Yeah, okay. It's my mouse, so this is a lot easier. Okay, so we want the best Volvo engine, don't we? There we go, hill traversal. Okay. Uh, let's see. It's all about the eye shift. Look at that hill traversal. Damn. Heavy cargo, that's what we're talking about there. Yeah, that makes such a huge difference. It's just absolutely ridiculous. Okay, innards. Let's have a look at the innards, man. Nice trim. Darker trim. Even darker. We go with that. Okay. New total is 184,000. Right. We gotta we gotta do the wussy colour. Gotta go the wussy colour. I don't think there's uh anything else that I'm really interested in. We can always change it at a later stage anyway, can't we? This is where the money comes in. This This part here. Particularly on the wheel front. Okay. And then the rims. Yeah, 
you know what? It doesn't really matter. I, I'm trying to keep it really, really simple. Yes, we're going to go chrome, baby. We're going to have our double strobes over there. Up at the top. Okay. Just going to keep it simplish. There. And the super raw there. I don't like those things. I don't want my license in the front. Front grill. Keep it chrome. Uh, exclusive fog lights. Yes, please. Nice. Bull bar. Hell yes. Look at that. Don't mess with me, man. Okay, not worried about those. Nice. Go pimp out this bitch, man. Orange side flares. Shit, yeah. What's that? Okay, that is styling. Or do we just go to the bottom? You see, I didn't even see it at the back. That's pretty rad. What does standard look like? Okay, it's a single. So the bottom you don't get to see it because of the flares. That's pretty cool. Fancy. Okay. Keep that as is. Okay, what do we got here? What is this? Yeah, we want to definitely... What's it going to take? 550 gallon as opposed to 450 gallon hell yeah we're going chrome baby chrome dome the whole way what have we got here oh funky yeah we keep it like that not so sure if I like those Yeah, yeah, that's the the under. You can't see it, which is pretty cool. I kind of like that. Okay, interior. Okay. Ooh. Yeah. Yeah. Volvo standard. Let's just go with that. Although the skulls look pretty cool. Anyway. Oh, those are those handle thingies? Yeah. Not really interested in those. Let's put the navigator up there. That could be pretty cool. What we got here? Okay, that's just that. Okay, we'll leave that as is. Chrome blinker. I'm going to spend all my money on this truck. Which I don't mind. Okay, let's put some fun things. Got to have an alien. Got to have our burger there. And yeah, we've got to have our wussy coffee. Down here, we've got to have a six pack of beer. Yeah. That's what I'm talking about. Gotta have a notebook to hand, you know. It's important to watch uh, exclusive leather. They're <laughs> styling. 206,000, they get. Uh, let's see. Can we get our uh, hanging friend again? Here we do. There we go, there he is. Okay, that's all that. 
That's fine. Holy shit, look at this place, man. I'm going to put some stickers on there because it looks boring. There we go. Got to put the guitar in. Yeah, maple syrup, just for Q. Baraka. Fuck yeah. Okay, are we here? Yeah, we've got to get yeah, Kiss Me, I'm a Trucker. Absolutely. Got to put the guitar case in, man. Can we get that to hang a guitar up somewhere? I guess not. That's some fancy shit, this, man. Yeah. We've got to have the, the, the cool box there. Absolutely. Confirm. 209,000. <laughs> Holy... Okay, it's gonna go to uh, here, there. Confirm that. Okay, let's exit out of here. Okay. Okay, now we're gonna come out, go to truck manager. Um, where is it? Truck manager. Okay. So this one is gonna be um, relocated to there okay oh we did buy a Volvo for somebody else already a second hand one probably okay the new one is can i take it no okay there we go oh no not good never mind okay how do i assign the new truck to me Drive it, okay. Or is it to the right? Game. Okay, never mind. Okay. There she is. Holy mother of. I like the fingers there. Just some lights. There we go. Right. We've got fog lights on there, but I have no idea how to put them on and put it in there. So that's in Los Angeles. That's where I am at the moment. Okay, so that we've got to give a hire a new driver. How 
do I relocate myself, man? Is it driver manager? Garage manager? Driver manager. Okay. Now Los Angeles, I want to relocate to... Uh, relocate. How the bloody hell am I supposed to do that? I don't know, that is just weird, man. Can I make it simple? Ooh, but I do like the inside. Eh, yeah, what do you think, guys? We got our new Volvo. Fancy. Fancy. Here it is. Anyway, we'll figure the rest of it out. Well, there we go, guys. Thank you so much for hanging out, man. That is bang on three hours for the stream. I appreciate guys hanging out. We'll be back again uh, tomorrow. We've got a whole lot happening. Tomorrow we've got the Planet Crafter with Shaleen. And again on Sunday as well. So I'm looking forward to that. Um, and then tomorrow we've also got around about 2 p.m. Uh, South African Standard Time. That'll be 1 p.m. GMT. Uh, F1. Uh, 23 on Twitch only. On Twitch. Uh, so that's happening. And then uh, Friday, nothing lined up yet except for one thing. That's confirmed. Around about 7 p.m. South African Standard Time, 6 p.m. GMT. It is my birthday bash radio DJ session. Yeah, going to be 52 on Monday. So I'm doing a special radio show uh, this Friday. I'll be playing all kinds of music that I like and whatnot so um try and get there because you know it makes sense and there's the link to the radio uh show please come in and uh follow the channel that's how you do it it's free get the app on your phone get the app on the pc whatever do your thing it's gonna be a whole lot of good rocking tunes chilled out vibes 80s rocking metal to celebrate me birthday Anyway, thanks for hanging, guys. I'll potentially see you later with some Death Stranding on Twitch. And there it is. There's the link on Twitch. Rightio, guys. Thank you for being here. As always, bloody awesome to have your company. And we'll be seeing you again really soon. Cheers, everyone. Ciao, ciao.